Yo, 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 what's happening, guys? Metaverse Melon here. How are we all today? So I've done the 30% sale yesterday. That's gone amazing, actually. If we actually look at it right now, I'm trying to keep my OPEX up for the factory and all the properties around it. So I've actually sold 21 properties um, in the last 24 hours, which is absolutely amazing. Probably, um, like, yeah, so here you can actually see all the way down. And it's just crazy. Just lowering the price of the property is in range for people to buy it. Just they sell straight away. And what people are saying is like they're under mint, but like um, I've put them under mint for a specific reason. When I bought these properties, I used this LA strategy. So as I was talking about at the start, I acquired a lot of properties in LA for the secondary market, the dollar strategy. Uh, so all my properties I sold off was worth about $4. Uh, so I'm getting like 7500 8500 You know what I mean? So that brought in about 30000 Upex profit um, and I generated over 200,000 Upex. What I did do though is I actually put some um, more Upex into the infrastructure around the factory guys so if you don't know already I'm currently building the factory. Uh, I'll just try and find it quickly. It's somewhere around here. Um, I might just have to cl click it in. It's Kingsbury Street so I'll just have a quick look for that. Let's just search for it quickly right now. I'm somewhere close to here. I just need to double check exactly. Kingsbury Street. Kingsbury Street like that. And then we'll have a look. It's just over here, so I wasn't far off. But yeah, this is basically where all the factory and everything's getting built right now. Um, we've actually got quite a lot of land and Squash Power watches a video. Shout out to Squash Power. He's actually bought some land as well around the factory. So uh, we've been speaking behind the scenes and that. I don't have any influence on the properties and the prices he puts them at. But hopefully we keep it at a really good price, you know, at like market rate or maybe 10% higher. Uh, just so everyone can get into it. And like, I think that'll be a really good way going forward. So you can actually see the factory here, guys. This is actually where I bought the land for the showroom. Uh, so then this actually becomes um, official because obviously um, I've not got my factory registered yet uh, but hopefully once cars come out they can just use this road here or this road down here to go to the factory to move infantry so it won't be too far away and then we're actually looking at buying the property around the factory so I'm just getting a few more here so if you want to get some of these properties like I'd get them quickly before they're all gone uh, we're going to start building on this guys like starting to put houses and like just build up the um, community around this kind of um, Grenada Hills it's quite big as well so we might actually make this a node but imagine just having like about four factories running and a couple of showrooms lower down in LA uh, I think that would just be awesome to actually have and see all like the different buildings uh, you can actually build around the factory so yeah get involved with that if you want to it's at 16830 piss um 16 8 30 kingsbury street sorry um if you want to put some spark on as well you also can do you just click on the button on the factory and then you just contribute some spark here these are all the players who are actually helping out supporting the build right now um, and once people put money on um spark on sorry i'll give away some upex to them once i get to the threshold i have to wait 60 days but i believe we've done 25 days now so we shouldn't be far off at all and this factory's only got 36 days and six hours left so this is what the community can do or not land uh, if if you all work together you can actually get something built and something like going so yeah this is really interested going forward i need to get five spark on the factory before i can actually start manufacturing or I, even before that i have to send away a meta venture application to upland so uh, before i can actually get building i need to create some items to sell in the factory so that's another thing we need to do and then we'll actually build the showroom and get involved with that and um, that'll be another contest obviously not really a contest but like if you support the build obviously i'll support you with upex and other stuff and i'm just keep growing in the account you can see this is just from today and um, with all the sends we're coming up to like four thousand upex so that's about four dollars so about 25 hours it takes me to get to here um, at the moment so we'll just collect the earnings and we can actually see the account is at five million seven hundred and seven it'll obviously go up now to seven hundred and ten seven hundred and eleven million but um this is actually crazy uh seven hundred eleven thousand sorry um, how big this account's actually gone because we're sitting yesterday at like 5,647,000 and I've just grown this account up by selling all these properties at the, um, the prices I did and everyone got a good deal on all those properties I sold as well so I felt good about it um, but everybody won on that one and I also won I actually made a few dollars off each property so like I ended up with about 40, 42 
thousand upex profit off just doing that one 24 hour sale so you can actually do it and you can sell properties if you have them at the right price the reason i could sell them so low though is because i actually bought them cheap about six months ago so those are all properties what i've actually been holding on to until like the price of the market's gone up a little bit and then i dropped the price uh, uh, yeah they came out well like that but i needed to be careful because if you buy something for five dollars which is five thousand upex so like, i bought in the secondary market for five dollars um so that was five thousand upex but obviously the price minted was about eight nine thousand upex uh, so you've got the eight nine thousand upex so i've obviously sold it for about eight and a half so it's been under mint value which was someone's got that property like a really good property out of that but i've also made a like the difference on the five dollars up to like the seven and a half or the eight and a half uh, which is good uh, obviously take away the upland tax which is five percent um so yeah that's going really well but obviously you get the returns on the property so even if i buy it for five dollars if it's bringing in like 140 a month and then i sell it it's going to cost me twelve thousand upex to buy another property at that price range so it's not ideal to sell all your properties off because if you actually look here you can see the property so all the properties i've got but you can actually see how much it's bringing in each month i had to buy obviously a few more properties so with all the profit well about 75 percent of the profit i've obviously put it back into like properties building um around the factory uh, so i've got it back up to 91,386. but this was going down it was costing me more upex to actually buy more properties obviously i get my like three dollars three and a half dollars every day but it was actually costing me more money to get the same generation on the property as it would be if i just didn't sell the properties so yeah i only wanted to get rid of a few in certain locations but that was good i'm going to advertise on twitter whenever i do another sale so yeah you can get involved and get some really good deals on properties um so yeah that's basically the factory guys i can't wait for cafes to come out as well cafes are coming out in the future uh, so that'll be really cool to actually see hopefully that's coming out in a few weeks i did see um upland on twitter did post something about cafes everyone getting excited um, are you going to apply for the meta venture uh, so i hopefully that would be really good to see like when it's out 3d experiences never seen in upland so yeah looking forward to that a lot and are you guys going to get a cafe as well where are you going to put your cafe are you based in la let me know in the comments down below if you're not subscribed already please do so like share and comment uh, that means the world to me as a small youtuber i'm trying to grow this youtube channel uh, trying to help out other uplanders so yeah i don't earn obviously a lot of money i put everything else i can into this game so every money i get on the end of the month um, I put back into this upland game and try and film every day so this takes me about an hour to an hour and a half to edit these videos and just upload them for yourselves so I really do appreciate all the support it does mean the world to me like we're getting up to 210 subscribers so that actually is crazy to see the account starting to grow now and obviously I'm off work so I can upload daily so I'm going to try and keep her that guys so yeah uh, you support me I'll try and support these videos for the rest of my time on upland so and I won't be on Upland, for, like, I'll be on Upland forever, so I see this being, like, a 20-year, 30-year journey. I see me playing this when I'm older, to be fair, so I just love the game, I love the idea. I love what's actually going to be coming to Upland as well, so once you can actually start to move around in the cities, uh, you'll able be able to drive, sorry, away to different towns. So eventually, if you had a lot of factories in LA but you wanted to like start selling and you sold as much profit like items as you could in LA you could actually like open a showroom in Bakersfield or if Santa Barbara comes out eventually and you could have like just one lorry going to Santa Barbara uh, to drop off items to sell in another showroom so the factory I've got is a medium factory so I believe I can actually start manufacturing carts and other stuff after Genesis week and um, I just need to look at the application forms because I'm actually new to Upland as well this is just basically showing you everything I do on Upland and all the stuff I've learned what well, i'm trying to just show you guys so you don't make the same mistakes because obviously it's a lot of money as well um you put in money into this game like real money so this is not financial advice please don't take this as financial advice this is just entertainment so uh, this is just like my opinion on the game but i really do believe that you can actually turn this the more value you bring to la well the more value i bring to la the more like the prices of the properties and the more people will get interested and want to move in just like everywhere just like dubai in real life you know once you start building something and like there's a lot of hype around that place a lot of people start moving in which will increase the taxes and other stuff so i really do believe in la and because it was counted out i got a lot of property cheap so that's why i was able to do that 30 percent off sale and still make profit um and then like a lot of players was getting 
in like cheap properties so that's a bit of fun i love doing that so tomorrow it's payday i will be putting some more money into the game but that's a surprise for tomorrow um i'm doing love the support on these videos as well so we'll run it again uh we didn't get 50 likes on the last videos but if we do get 50 likes on this video i will be giving away 5,000 up picks to one lucky winner we'll put everyone's names on the wheel again so if you comment down below your upland username on this video you'll be entered into the competition and then we'll spin the wheel every video this um, gets 50 likes just comment with your Insta um, upland username and then obviously once i spin the wheel your name will be added to that wheel so you could be in chance of winning the 5,000 up picks so i'll run that every video i get once it gets to the next video and obviously that's about 24 hours i will do a new competition so every video it comes out so basically if this video is uh finished and then a new one comes out the competition's finished and the new competition starts but if the new video doesn't come out and the video hits 50 likes you'll get obviously the 5,000 upex in the next video's uh, competition so yeah get involved with that guys um, i do love the support on these videos let me know what you want me to do in upland as well let me know where you want me to go la's really good right now but i was actually thinking about london next year this isn't right now so this is a factory the showroom everything's getting built here but once the factory's up and running, I really, realistically, I need to put about another $2,000 into Upland to get to the 10 million mark. And then also um, with the Spark, I'll need to put a little bit into Spark as well. Probably have to buy about two Spark because once I get to 10 million, obviously I'll be able to get the 1.2 Spark on Spark Week. So if you don't know, if you upgrade on Spark Week, you actually get a, like a percentage, so obviously a 20% increase on mine. Uh, when I go from director to executive. So I'll get the 1.2 spark on top of that. So that'll get me to about 2.76. With my daily logins, I'll get to about 2.9. To, uh, three roughly and then obviously i'll buy the rest in spark which will probably be two spark i think the 460 right now 460 dollars uh so 800 920 dollars uh, worth of spark on top of probably about 2000 in the game so about three grand in total i'll put into upland and then try and get this up i'll put a few hundred dollars in tomorrow we'll make some videos i'll show you the secondary market strategies again um, i'll show you where i buy my properties to grow my account and then we'll show you the journey up to 10 million guys um, i'm loving the support thank you so much for the watch time i'm actually seeing a lot of people are watching more through the video and i know that's because like i'm getting better at like the way i'm like presenting these videos well i hope i am uh, let me know down below if you're actually enjoying this content if i'm speaking too fast if it's too like you know just let me know down below i really do appreciate the feedback uh, i just really hope you're actually following along and enjoying the content um, i really do love making these videos and i really do appreciate all the support it just seems weird that it's me like i watched all these videos for years and it's just nice to actually be making this content for you guys so thank you so much i really do love the support and that's basically it for this video um i don't know what else is really happening to be fair like it's quite slow at the moment we've already talked about the caps obviously like it's bit coming in um so it'll be seven thousand up picks and then this will get stopped so once i hit seven thousand i've already collected this but it'll just go through again and um, once i get to seven uh, seven thousand up picks the cap will stop so obviously i won't be able to accumulate any more up picks so it'll be stuck until i collect the earnings and then it'll obviously every hour every three hours you get your up picks again uh, so that's coming to the game to stop like obviously players what are um inactive on the game and also if you've got a small account you know if you've got like hundreds of little accounts on upland and you're trying to transfer money or like buy fsa properties and transfer them to other accounts it's just harder because you've obviously got access every single phone individually and like you know what i mean i think it's like 40 or 100 for the one levels below so yeah like you'll be logging in every single every couple of hours if you make if, you know what i mean like just to collect rent so um, it doesn't really help them small players, but it will entice small players to be in the game. So I believe it is good for Upland also. I believe like the more users what are actually registered in the game each day actually drives up price. Uh, increases the price of upland overall so they can get higher investment more like better graphic designers better like teams come into the game to start to grow la out you know you can get involved with other companies like different partnerships not act like maybe activision sorry other places like that you know to get actually the in-game graphics or even like um what's the other one um in la you're talking about gta um oh what's the name of it again gta um there's the studios in edinburgh as well um oh what's it called oh that's gonna really bug me now let me know down in the comments below but it's so simple i've just forgotten the name of it um <laughs> that's gonna annoy me right but anyway 
Uh, let me know down below, guys, what you actually want me to build in this Saltland game. Um, let me know what you're doing with your content as well. It's really nice catching up with you. I hope you enjoyed the last video with a townhouse giveaway. Um, I just hope you're enjoying the game in general. Uh, show this video to all your friends. Please get the support to Upland. Let's grow this together. As a community, we can accomplish so much. So, yeah, let's support each other and keep this game amazing, guys. Uh, thank you for watching. Love you all. See you in the next video. Peace.